everybody, this is Sean Powell. I wanted to talk about something that I think is really going to help a lot of you. Uh, I'm definitely going to be putting this in my training section, and I'm going to try to cover it kind of not in thorough detail as much as I probably could because it would really stretch the video out. I think this is more of, you know, just getting you an idea of where you needed to go. So I'm going to title this Power Lead Systems Day One, What Do I Do? Okay. Um, the reason I'm going to say that, I think this is very, very important. Let me go to the Facebook group. I will show you. So this is going to be the official Power Lead Systems Facebook group, right? 39,000 members in it. Constantly, if you come here, you'll notice that people start off on day one. Their very first question is, I'm here. I'm excited. Wow, these are great people. They can sense us are great people here. But what do I do? Okay. So I broke it down into eight sections to get you on track into a routine and a game plan that's going to work for you to get you going inside of Power Lead Systems. Okay. So let's go ahead and get started. I, I, I I'm, you know, want to go ahead and get the same going. First thing that you need to do when you get inside of Power Lead Systems, y'all. Get to get started here. The first thing you need to do when you get inside of Power Lead Systems is you need to remove the fog that's around Power Lead Systems. Okay, so if if you're there and you're standing there and you don't know what to do, why do you think your downline would be any differently? They're not. Okay, so to me, finding solutions makes a difference than you know than just getting people in as well. So. I want to give you the game plan to go with. That's what you want to have as well. What kind of, you know, what exactly do you want to do? So removing the fog to me is going to remove the people from standing in the Facebook group asking the constant questions of, I don't know what to do. You know, uh, where's my referral link? You know, they're used to signing up and seeing a referral link, you know, just, just staring them in the face. This is different than what they're used to, to be honest. So there's a little bit of learning curve. You know, and, and, and that's what I'm saying. You really want to guide people at the beginning because who wants to get in a business and feel lost? So that to me, that's the one that's really one of the most important times of your business. All right, so this is right, right. Power Lead Systems, day one, what do I do? Remove the fog around Power Lead Systems. How do you do that? What's the solution? Share codes. Share codes is the solution to removing the fog around Power Lead Systems. Okay. Now, I'm going to show my share code. It is not the only one by no means, if I can find it. Okay, that'll work. Okay, so the share code itself is, is the one I've got for Power Lead Systems, right? Okay, why is the share code so important? Because it gives them the chance to make their own share code. When someone first gets in Power Lead Systems, I tell them to go ahead and get a share code just about if, if they're planning on running with it or not, the reason why is so many people that come into Power Lead Systems are going to be using share codes. It'd be really nice that if their sponsor knows how to put a share code together. The beauty of it is almost all share codes are done the same. There's not a whole lot of variation between it. So what you need to do is you need to do a share code once or twice, at least a couple of times maybe, and when you're done, you'll have the ability to help somebody else. You understand what I'm saying? And that's what I do. I make it really simple. I have a lot of people who are good, you know, just getting into Power Lead Systems who are using this share code that has never done anything with Power Lead Systems and are not even having to ask me, you know, for advice or getting lost. So I know I do a good job with that. So they should be able to do the same thing. Okay. Now, a good sponsor. To be honest, you don't want to, uh, uh, what do you want to call it, babysit them too much. What does that mean? It means they go through, they get the share code, you know, they go to the page and put everything together, wh wherever they're going, wherever you're sending them to, you know, universally for Power Lead Systems with a share code. Don't pop in and do it for them. If you do that, they're not learning anything, and they're not going to be able to help their downline. How are they going to run their business if they can't even do that? You see what I'm saying? Now, that doesn't mean that you don't help them. I'm saying let them learn. There's a difference between helping and letting them learn, especially on day one. So what I would suggest doing is showing them what to do 
as far as where they need to go. Here's this, you know, instead of here's the sales page, there's the, uh, you know, just follow it, go to number two, get your sales page right here, and just listen to what it tells you to do. And, it's, and you, when you're done, you'll have a working sales funnel that you'll be able to get out to people, you know, start, start getting leads. Now, in the process of them getting out there, if they get lost in the process by trying, then you help. What is my idea of helping? If it's something real, real simple I could tell them right then, that's fine. If I know they have really beaten, banged, and just, just had a hard time, they're, they're struggling, which I'd be asking, did I do something wrong in my sales funnel, you know, for to have that? But that's fine. You learn. You got to listen to your people. If that's the case, I will go into their account. I don't know if you know this or not, but inside of Power Lead Systems, we've got something that if you go under account, go under my business, and if you see right here, it says switch admin accounts. What that does is it allows me to go in someone else's account without using their username and password, but it's only allowed if they okay it. I can't just go in and out without their permission. It's, it's got to be okayed by them. And while I go into their account, and which I've done a many, I'm going to go ahead and tell you, I've got a bunch of people I've, I've gone to their accounts to help. And it's a real good way to bond between you and someone else. But at the very beginning, it's like I said, give them the chance to try it. Okay. Now, when I go into their account to fix something, I usually will make a short YouTube video. And it's just for them alone. So that whatever I'm fixing, they will see what I fixed. And they will learn what I fixed. You do something like that, y'all. It's going to bind you closer to your people. And it's, it's priceless. That's something that you really want to have to take place. So I want to get too sidetracked on that, but that's what you want to do. You want to let them learn without doing it for them all the time, especially at day one. Okay? Share codes, they should be able to do it. They start venturing out maybe later on, making their own landing pages and sales pages, and they're going to be asking you questions. Well, you know what? That's your job. That's your job. You know what I'm saying? It's to be there. Plus, what you don't know, they're in the official Power League Systems group, y'all. That's 40,000 people. There's a lot of talented people in there that love Power Lead Systems. They need to be around that community in the first place. Okay. So, number one, share codes because it go ahead, it go ahead, it'll go ahead and get them started going down the path that they need to go so they can go ahead and get up and going. And they'll have something that's going really good in a short period of time. And not only that, it's going to be quality a lot better. And them starting off with some blank page inside of Power Lead Systems and don't know what they're doing and they're trying to make something, they're going to get discouraged. My opinion, and so many people are going to use share codes. Anyhow, I'm talking like 90% of my people, first day they come in, I tell them, here y'all, do the share code. Even if you don't do it, just, just take the share code and get used to it so you'll know how to do them. Because once you've done one, you've basically, basically done just about all of them. You can do them, any of them. See what I'm saying? It's that important. So to, to lift the fog, what do you do? I would highly su suggest share codes on day one. So you'll go ahead and have something up and going. Not only that, the number one thing that happens as soon as a new person gets their link and see that it works, they feel great about Power Lead Systems. That alone is, is tremendous. They feel like they've got something that they can run with and they learn how to do something today and they feel good about it. And that's a great thing. Okay, So you want them using their tools. But how to lift that fog up is a big, big thing, okay? All right, number two. Let me show you something here. Power lead systems, y'all. There's a bunch of things you can do in here, right? You, you, you'd really be surprised. There's a lot more under the training session, under, you know, what all you could do. Man, you're talking about making sales funnel duplicators. Uh, you know, I'm not trying to intimidate anybody, but there's a lot of things up here that you can learn, a lot of different things that you can make, and, and all sorts of things, right? Okay. Think of Power Lead Systems as if it's a dictionary, okay? What does that mean? It means, do you read the entire dictionary just to use it for what you need it for? Of course not. Power Lead Systems is no different. I mean, it is no different whatsoever. You don't have to have a PhD in business just to use Power Lead Systems. And to be honest, there's features that I don't even do, I haven't done, I haven't learned, nor have I needed to. I've, I've made really good money in online business, and I didn't, you know, I didn't, obviously didn't need that. Learn what you need to learn, 
to use what you need to use it for. And later on, if you decide to use it for something else, then learn that, just like you would a dictionary. Keeping it simple like that, y'all, makes a big difference, and it keeps you people and keeps you from getting intimidated, okay? So you don't get intimidated. Number two, this is getting it, okay? Well, obviously, you know, you go through, you, you become gold. Second one is get all in. Y'all, I can tell you, anybody who's going to take power of these systems seriously, and they've already got a share code, they got something going to get out to people. Let me go ahead and tell y'all, y'all, I'm, I'm going to say, this video right here that I've got, it hounds out. It just constantly hounds diamond and platinum, okay? And it works. Do you really want to be in your gold business, I mean, just gold in power of these systems, where you're giving away your uh, $100 commissions and your $400 commissions left and right? And believe me, y'all, I haven't had a week that I don't get diamonds and, and platinums. And let me tell you something else, too. When you first start in, in, in you know, power of these systems, how this thing pays is every other one goes as a pass-up, right? Well, they're only $20 each, even though it's residual pay. That's great. It's going to take you a little bit of time to build a substantial amount of income. These diamonds and these platinums are going to be worth more to you than the golds at the beginning. Definitely at the beginning. So the last thing you want to be doing is to be promoting this business while you're not all in it. Because if you use this share code, y'all, I can tell you, I I've got a lot of credibility. I've got a lot of you know, I've got a lot of diamonds. I know how to get diamonds. I'll be talking about that in just a little bit too. If you're not qualified in it, you're just going to be giving away money. And who's it going to go to? Me, or whoever your upline is, because we know the game. We have got to get in. You got to get all in. You got to get leads. Okay? So that's how it goes. Get in, get all in. You got to get leads. So let's talk about that. Let's talk about getting leads. But you do want this page to be all green as soon as you can. Okay? That's, that's, that's very important. Okay. So uh, focus at getting leads. Now, this is really going to help you a lot of y'all right here because I'm not even just talking about how to get going in Power Lead Systems. I'm going to go ahead and tell you today how to get going, getting leads so that you can start making money with Power Lead Systems, okay? So when you very first start in Power Lead Systems, I don't really care how you want to focus at people. Uh, if it's Facebook, YouTube, solo ads, Craigslist, whatever new fangled thing you've got that you want to do, as long as, you know, somebody's made it down every avenue, it really won't matter. To me, I don't really care what you pick. The big thing is, is the fact that you pick one of those and then you feel comfortable with that. You're going to have to get comfortable doing it and getting really good at it and being consistent about it. Consistency doesn't only just bring the results from you. Consistency brings the other people around you because they see you're consistent. Consistency alone, people acknowledge that you're a workhorse for your business. You're a beacon for that business, and it's going to bring more people. Okay? So what you need to do, y'all, is focus it one way of getting out to people. Don't really matter what you pick. Now, in my mind, for what I'm going to be teaching here, I'm, I'm going to be thinking Facebook. Okay, because so that's the first one I picked. But whatever you want, initially use what I'm saying and put it towards that. If it's not Facebook, it's whatever. It really won't matter. Okay. Day one, I'm in online business. I ain't done a damn thing. I don't know anything, right? I've got my sales link. My, uh, I'm up and going. <clears throat> what did I do? That worked for me. And it seemed like common sense, but I guess a lot of people don't get it. I didn't have credibility yet. I had excitement. I had, you know, new belief in a business, and I knew that I was going to be all in it. So whether or not I had gold yet, just gold or all this done, I can't really remember right from the very beginning. I know it went diamond pretty soon. <clears throat> but, you know, I had a lot of belief in the business. So I was getting out, and people could sense that. What I did was I made the bullet points. Those are things that are great about a business that you're looking at. And I included my sponsor, okay? Or I included somebody in the Facebook group who was being really successful. Um, that can work for y'all right by itself. You, this is just the part I'm going to tell you. Use someone else's credibility until you make your own credibility. And it's going to help you make momentum. Momentum is going to be a big part of your game right here. I'm going to tell you that. Okay? So if you have...
someone else's credibility. This is how I use it. My sponsor in the first business I got into, he was um, from Tennessee. He was in the medical field, and he got free from a job in two years. That blew my mind. I knew he was making pretty good money. He had to be doing something pretty good to walk away from that financial that he was making, and he had you know a family to support. And I was like, you know what? I don't have that credibility. I, I would love to make it my goal, and I did it in six months, <laughs> believe it or not. So I was, I was smoking, that's for sure. But I used his credibility until I created my own credibility mixed with my excitement and belief that people could sense. You see what I'm saying? So that kind of worked for me. And that kind of it really did work for me. Okay. So, and I, I give you another example too, y'all. There's a guy I know. His name is Jeff. He did mediocre in online business. He, he did well. He just, the results weren't there for him. You've seen people like before do really good, but it just, it just mediocre results. I felt like he should have been doing better, to be honest, considering how professional and everything he did. That's how it goes sometimes, y'all. Um, but he got into a brand new business. And he didn't have any credibility for that brand new business. He had someone in his Facebook group that had made $19,000 in seven days in that business. So what he did was he did a YouTube videos. And in the YouTube videos, he'd show a screenshot of that money that that person made. Now listen real careful. He didn't say their name. He didn't have to. I would suggest not, to be honest. Would you really want to say my name if I'd made $20,000 in a week and then these people bypass you and go look me up? Of course not. What you need to do is show people that you believe in your business. And this is about how I did it, y'all. Look, I'm going to show you something. This, this is him talking. I'm going to show you a screenshot, y'all. This person's in our Facebook group. I know him personally. I've seen him make this, y'all. This is as legit as it gets. $19,000 in seven days. This is absolutely incredible. It blew my mind away to see this. He's not the only one getting results like this. I see other people in the Facebook group that's getting the same kind of results. This is what I want to do. I want to make this my, you know, this is my goal. So I'm, I'm pushing as hard as I can to make this my business. You know, just be sincere and let go. When you do that, it comes across as that way. Even though he had zero money, what happened is after the next 24 hours, he made $2,000 in his business. Now, let's use that as a reference. He used someone else's credibility to help him start his credibility. Once he has that credibility, what's he going to do? It produced a little bit of momentum. He's going to create more momentum. Okay? How do you create more momentum, y'all? By, by taking the new that you've got, that new credibility, new momentum that you've made with timestamps up there, right? It's going to show where the people came in, where you got paid, blah, 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 and stuff like that, right? And those timestamps are pretty valuable, y'all. I can tell you that. And, and I've, I said in another video recently, if you have one and it doesn't have this timestamps, I'm trying to teach from day one, but let's say that you stepped away for a little while and you came back and you've, you've made money in, in Power Release Systems or whatever business, but this is six months ago. Then don't show that timestamp over here for this one. You've got credibility. Just people are going to question, why are you showing images from last August? It's been a year ago. It just doesn't make sense. Well, I agree. That's why you should take the timestamp off from that image. So just you know, take a, a, a you know, take a screenshot without that. Use that at the beginning to produce the momentum. Once you got that momentum coming in now, that now money, then you take that and then you start putting in the screenshots. And next thing you know, you use that to make more momentum. Now here's the thing, y'all. A lot of you, and this momentum is actually number four in this, y'all. Make momentum your momentum. Okay, so you're talking about using someone else's credibility to start making your own. Okay, now number five is once you start making your momentum, you make more momentum. Now I know this sounds crazy, but you would think that you know when I'm starting to make money, that you'd put the the foot down to the floor, put the pedal to the ground, right? A lot of y'all don't. I'm gonna tell you that to the point that I've literally had to put it in here. You got to keep your foot, you got to keep your foot on the floor, and keep going. And let's, like I said, I've made 20,000 in seven days. I wound up making 40,000 in, 40, uh, in 30 days, right? 31,000 in 13 days. I wouldn't have got there if I'd let off the pedal. Not with momentum like that that is showing 
timestamps and things of that nature, right? You have got to keep the foot down. And a lot of y'all, you think it's, it's, it's vacation time. It's not. Once you get that momentum going, you, you put it down even harder. I went a long time lacking sleep because of the momentum. It's, it's, uh, oh man, how do, how do you, how do you say it? You know, it's like athletes at the top of their sport. Um, people that race motocross, I was big, in, I raced motocross for 10 years growing up. They get on this roll and they don't let off. You know, you can't let off. That's, that's your momentum. That's, you've built something it, it, and, and it just, it works for you, right? I'm going to show you an example of this, y'all. Okay. Okay, I just got another lead right here. This is 87 leads that I've got in two days, right? Um, I could click here. It's going to show some emails, though. I can already tell you that. But one just came in right there. My Internet's been out. Last night, about 7 o'clock, somewhere in the ballpark, I started posting, laid on the couch with, uh, um, with Facebook and my phone. I love using my phone <clears throat> to post on Facebook. I got like 40 some leads yesterday in the last 20 in less than 24 hours because it's not even seven o'clock yet so i got um over 40 leads in the last 24 hours and i only got on facebook one time i got up this morning about 10 o'clock and i was going to do it again my internet was out i couldn't do videos until, until recently me and my little boy went out and enjoyed the day we came back home and he played video games and we laid on the middle of the floor and i about fell asleep watching him play videos now i probably did fall asleep but, you know, and, and that's what we did to keep ourselves entertained while the Internet was out. And as soon as the Internet came on, we decided this is when I thought about this. I need to make a video for day one. So, um, but I just want to let you know, you know, this is me getting out um, on Facebook. This is the right time, y'all. Um, you get out there and you put content out there that means something to you. It's going to grab attention and people are going to want to check it out. Okay. So let's go to, uh, let's see. So number five is make more momentum. Keep the foot on the floor. Number six, use social media to be a beacon and to link people to the business. Okay, let me show you what that's about. Okay, Power Lead Systems is right here. Okay, here's a good example. Travis, right? Um, Travis is not in my business. I, I don't know if he's ever been in one of my businesses with me or not. I know we've talked a couple times about other things. He may be in another business of mine, but he's not in my Power Lead Systems business. But if he notices here, that he's made uh, a presence for himself in the group. He's showing where he's applying action, and often he'll show where he's bringing in new members. So people look at him as being someone getting a job done. He's a go-getter, right? Okay. Well, if I was sponsoring you, wouldn't you want to see that inside the Facebook group? You understand what I'm saying? You want see? This is me. This is me posting, talking back to him, uh, helping him. A couple of things I did. And if I go a little further down, here's a good example right here where it shows him, you know, bringing in a new member. This is making a presence for yourself that your people that you're bringing in can see that you believe in this business. You are a beacon for that business, for Power Lead Systems. So how, how can you make a presence for yourself and it doesn't cost anything? Let me show you my action takers too. This is my own official Facebook group, my own Facebook group. Okay. See if I can't get down here and show it. Okay, here's some uh, me helping one of my, this is one of my leads that came in yesterday. And again, this is me showing some of the YouTube videos I've made, me making a presence inside my own Facebook group. This is my next door neighbor. His car was messed up. Um, he, he's always helped me out. I gave him $600 yesterday to go get his car because it was messed up. And uh, he messed up the front end and someone fixed it. But anyhow, you know, so it's me staying connected to my people um, inside of a Facebook group. But when I welcome someone into my Facebook group and then they, they really get a chance to see me putting out content like this, uh, helping people out, uh, putting motivational things in there. Got all sorts of, you know, just motivational things that I've learned while I've been applying action, things of that nature um, that I really like to share with my people in my group. Um, I show pictures of diamonds where I've done, you know, well, here's a good example, y'all. This guy right here asked, could he just come in as, as, as diamond, I mean, as gold only? And, of course, I answered him. But let me show you this, y'all. This is one of my screenshots of the diamonds. I don't know if you can see all of them. And to be honest, I could not put any more than this one and still be able to read it. But I've got a lot, a lot, a lot more diamonds than this. 
But this motivates him. It motivates other people who bring people into the Facebook group. You understand what I'm saying? So you want to have that people around that community to see what's possible that you can make and do with this business. And when you're around people that love that business, when I first got my, my first businesses, y'all, I didn't have a sponsor, really. I, I'd seen what he'd done, but he wasn't there for me. He was, And to be honest, I didn't need him. I didn't need him. And I'm not putting him down or anything. It's just he was doing another business. He'd already cleared out from the business I was just getting into. So I had to rely on my own instincts, a belief in the business, and, and thank God I did, y'all. God does things for a reason. I can tell you that, right? And he put me around the right kind of people in a Facebook group, and I learned what I needed to learn by applying action and just knew that if I'm not getting seen, I'm not going to grow, and I knew I wasn't going to quit. And then later on, uh, about a month later, I learned that if I focused it one way of getting out to people, that that focus and knowing I wasn't going to quit put everything together for me. That's really all it took. What happened? In six months, I was free from a job. 65 hours a week, having half my week gone from my little boy to home every day. Freedom. And has not ever looked back since. It's amazing, y'all. Sometimes I look at, I look at my bank account sometimes and I'm like, wow. Most money I ever had in my bank while working 65 hours a week for 26 years was $15,000. Now I keep fifty, sixty thousand dollars $60,000 while paying for a car, paying the house off, paying for an, a second mortgage, helping my next door neighbors. Like I said, $600 just to help him because he's, he's someone who doesn't ask for anything that helps everybody. It's a blessing, y'all, to be able to do these things. It really is. And anybody can do it. It's not hard, y'all. It's really not. Okay, so social media is number six. You want to get these people connected to you and see you because they want to feel good about their sponsor. That's what they want to do. They want to know that they made the right decisions. Okay, have a game plan. This is pretty simple, y'all. And let me tell you <coughs> what a, having a game plan can be. As simple as saying, every time I get someone into the business, I'm going to explain to them what diamond is. I'm going to tell them to go diamond. Okay? Now, as simple as that may sound, as far as telling somebody to go diamond, let's say go platinum as well. You know, obviously both. But let me let me tell you what it does. I've been in for over two years. I still average one out of every three people I sponsor that goes diamonds. That is a stupid ratio for two years. I got 27 diamonds in 30 days in one month. How did that happen? My game plan was simple. Number one, I want them to sign up. Number two, I want them to friend me on Facebook. So their call to action and that follow-up email is go ahead and sign up, y'all. you got a seven-day trial. Uh, really get a chance to see what this thing's about. This thing's the answer to any business, not just power lead systems, any business. Okay? Then I tell them to frame me on Facebook, and I'll personally welcome into the Facebook group. Okay? And then you do that. You do exactly what you say you're going to do. And it's real simple. You saw, you know, go to Power Lead Systems, you'll see people do it all day long. Okay, now, so my first call to action is to get them into the business. Second call to action, as soon as they sign up, is, y'all, let, let me go ahead and explain to you what Diamond is. And then I go in detail explaining to them. This is what Diamond is. $147 one time. You get $100 for every time someone falls on your pay line. You get pass-ups as well. And not only that, y'all, out of the $147, $125 $125 of it goes back to the people. So if one of my downline gets paid $100, I get paid $25 just because I was next in line sponsored. That's more than fair. And you only got to pay for it one time. And let's say if I go diamond and you don't, and the next 10 people down below you don't go diamond, the 11th one down there, for whatever reason, she gets in, you know, you didn't have anything to do with it because why would you tell her to go diamond? You ain't qualified. But maybe she's in my Facebook group. Maybe I motivate her. Maybe she, maybe she likes my landing page sales page. She, she, somebody motivated her. Maybe she's just smart, right? She goes diamond and platinum. What's going to happen? It's going to bypass every one of y'all, all 10 of you, and go to the next one in line. And guess who that is? It's me because I'm qualified. I made five platinums um, in the last 30 days. Do you think I got all of them directly myself? No. How did some of them come? From people not being qualified. So it's either you're going to get all in or you plan planning on give your money away. Me personally, I don't like giving my money away. 
I lost two platinums in 30 days. That's $800, and it still haunts me to today. So me telling people about that game plan and sticking with it each and every time, every time. I have a good follow-up email, y'all. Follow-up email is also going to have, this is number eight, and this is the last one, y'all. Number eight is going to be having a really good follow-up email where you tell them who you are. I'll tell you what, I'll do better now. I will show you an example of my follow-up email. This is my own personal notes, for, uh, new Facebook ad for groups. I stay organized for this, y'all. It takes big letters. I'm a simple person. Okay, this is uh, email to sign-ups. Okay, so these are people that already came into the business. I'm not going to see that one. Uh, say emails to leads. Okay, I want you to check this one out, y'all. I hope you can see me okay. I just moved it around. Okay, <clears throat> I'm not going to read all of it. It's like, hey, this is Sean, my little boy Adam. We wanted to, um, to tell you congratulations and some thanks for coming through and seeing my personal power lead systems. Okay, you're much appreciated. Okay, and now I tell people, um, I like to give people the hand, the, the keys to the car. You know, I tell them, look, y'all, you go ahead and go through here. Here's the share code. You go ahead and put this in, y'all. And this will give you, a, you know, you'll be up, up and running in no time. And you get a free seven-day trial on top of that. Then I give them a big, big tip. Don't be that person that signs up and does nothing. You'll never change anything that way ever. I made over 40000 in 30 days in online business. And I could not have done it without Power Lead Systems. Okay? Using my credibility. It didn't have to be that. It could have been that brand new person. You know, you can tell people what this business can mean to you. You know, here's something like this. Y'all, I've only been in this business for a month and a half. And I'm already seeing light in the tunnel. These people love this business. I love this business. If you really need to, to get around these people, go ahead and sign up. Frame me on Facebook. I'll personally welcome you into the Facebook group. And you need to get around these people and see what this thing can really do for you. Okay? Here's the answer. Here's the keys. Here's the share code right here. Y'all, just go through it, and, and you know, th that's how it is, man. It's just being sincere. Never act like you're trying to sell anything. You don't have to sell anything. All you got to do is understand this person watched my video because they wanted to watch it. They clicked my link because they were interested. It's like somebody driving to my house who's interested in, in you know, in what I do. I don't feel like I'm selling anything. All I got to do is tell them what I think. If I didn't believe in my business in the first place, why the hell did I pick it in the first place? You don't. You always pick businesses you believe in, and you get out there, and you keep getting seen. You know that you're not going to quit. That's that's just it, okay? So that's what my uh, follow-up email looks like. It's a little longer than some people's probably are. Um, so I, I, you know, a couple of things. So recap of everything you sign up, you do that, uh, you do that part. Uh, frame me on Facebook. You need to get uh, fully aligned. I was talking about going uh, diamond and platinum. Uh, let's see here. It is the share codes right here and join Action Taker Success Group. That's my own Facebook group. So you get a chance to be in it. And I show them another proof of income. I always put my name here. I put my phone number here. And I put a link back to the business. Always. Always. When I first got an online business, I didn't know any better. And without my follow-up email, I couldn't have gotten back to it, to be honest. I would have signed up underneath someone else. So I always want to uh, provide them solutions by having this right here. And they say, I don't know if I've seen it true or not, but they say the average person looks in a business over seven times before they sign up. And if that's true, you know, I sure as hell hate to know that, that they had to keep my uh, link opened up here all the time to get back to it. Because that's, that's the answer right here. So when I send out a follow-up email, which is more than 50% of the emails I get back total ever comes from that one follow-up email that I get. So I always want to provide them as that with that link back to it, access to me, and better than that, here is my Facebook. Tell them they can connect directly to me and that I'm there every day. That's what a follow-up email does for you. So, y'all, that's, that's just a recap. If I was day one, come in with a share code. It, it, it takes away the fog. Learn how to do share codes. Don't do your share code for your downline because all you already know how to do it. You don't want it to. You're good to go, y'all. It's real simple. But don't do their share code for them. Let them try. Fix their problems. Explain to them what they did wrong so they'll, they'll learn from it. But at least they're trying. And then you want to get in. You want to get all in into your business. You want to use credibility because you don't have none. You can create credibility by using someone else's credibility, right? So you make your own credibility. You make your own momentum. Use that momentum to make more momentum. You keep the hammer down. You don't let go. You don't quit. 
You start posting in social media to let people know that you're a beacon for them, and you bring those people into the business, and then uh, your game plan is going to be those call to actions. Every time I get someone in, every time I get someone in, what's the first thing I'm going to do? I'm going to talk about going diamond, the importance of going diamond. Things like that make a big difference. What most people are missing is they assume people will figure it out. Assuming is a huge percentage drop, especially in when it comes to upgrading. Tell them they want to hear their sponsor. They don't want a boss man, but they do want to be managed when they're brand new in the business. And, and that's exactly what you're going to be doing. You're going to be managing them for what they need to be doing, and they're going to do the same thing, and it's going to teach them how to make money. That's how you do it. Call to actions is as important as a landing page, period, or a sales page. It's that important. And the last part is good follow-up email. And I can tell y'all, you know, since I made this email up here and I've got it, I've redone it three times. <laughs> you know, uh, I thought it was a little long, so I went back and cut it a little bit shorter. I use all my follow-up emails through my phone, so I don't have my phone with me right here. But I do make copies of about what I'm running at that time, so I have some ballpark. So I have it. Um, I believe in leaving. I live off of notes, I can tell you that. But um, nothing wrong with tweaking here and there and, and, and fixing issues, addressing issues. Try to make it more clarity for someone and put them call to actions. If you don't put call to actions, they won't do it. People will walk around the hallways of your business like they're lost. But if you would have told them what to do, tell them, look, y'all, go ahead and sign up. You got a seven day trial anyhow. Go ahead and put that share code together. You'll get the same. You start getting out the people. Frame me on Facebook. I'll personally welcome you into the Facebook, uh, Facebook group. You get a chance to see what this thing can really do. Those are call to actions. If you noticed, all that sounds really sweet. Do you know what I really wanted? And to sign up right from the beginning. That's what I wanted. But I said that right from the beginning, let the cat out the bag, and everything else sounds like I'm giving them something. That's how you do it. It's not hard. Okay, so in this video, y'all, this is day one. If I was just coming in, that's exactly what I would do. And like I said, it can, it can change your life. You need to take power lead systems seriously. Uh, here is my... I'll show you both. Okay, this is my actual um, sales page right here that you come into. Sign up at Power Lead Systems. If you click, uh, get your sales page right here. And not only that, y'all, here's the Wednesday and Thursday's webinar. Uh, you can watch them live at 10 o'clock on the Eastern time. Uh, as soon as they come in, you get to watch them live right here inside your own sales funnel, which is really, really sweet. Here's the facts. It explains everything as far as the pay and how everything works inside of Power Lead Systems. That's right here. It's accessible to you as well. And if it's not live, they've already got the other recording still there. So anytime people like to watch it, they can watch it. You've got your own Facebook just right here. So people can get a chance to, you know, uh, hear somebody. They came through and left a comment here. So, of course, I answered back. So, you know, it's not hard, y'all. This is, this, this, is, this is what you want to have in your sales funnel. And when they're ready to put their sales funnel together, they're going to click here. And it's going to take them to, that's my training page, sorry. Started adding some training pages into it recently, matter of fact. Okay, here you go. So what they do is they watch the video. It's real simple. I show it in video. They even show it down here. And once they're done, they'll have a link, and they start getting out the people. And, uh, again, there's the webinars. That's what they look like. This is Franco Gonzalez, and you can uh, uh, chat to people while they're doing it. If they click any of these buttons, it's going to take them right into your business. See what I'm saying? Once you get the share code put together, and if somebody wants to know how to get out the people, and you know, I've got very elaborate details, and this would be one of the videos I'm more likely to put in here. And I showed people exactly what I'm doing. This is $1,600 in six days I made. Again, I think I was talking about uh, email marketing, but this is something that I would use, you know, for producing momentum, you know, exact same way. So I'm gonna go ahead and end the show. If you're serious about Power Lead Systems, click the link down below. Just go ahead and get in this thing. I know new changes that are coming real soon. It's gonna you want to be on the tidal wave and catch this ride in. I can tell you that. First time I've ever promoted Powerly Systems directly, I always use another primary business. But with all the changes that's got coming up, a lot of great things are coming. I said, you know what? I don't even need another business with this. This thing is rock solid. Paid me two years nonstop like clockwork. Every Wednesday is a weekly payday. And it's only cost me a dollar to send it to my bank. There's nothing better than this. Okay? So click the link. Sign up, frame me on Facebook. I welcome you in the Facebook group, and I look forward to seeing you there. Appreciate it.